Uh, it feel good, you know. Um, this this is just the game we needed, you know, to build some momentum. You know, um, I just want. I'm proud of the freshmen. You know, they came through when we when we need them the most. You know, we was in foul trouble. You know, they they stepped up big. You know, if we if they continue doing that, we can go a long ways. So I'm excited. Mike, they say good things come to those who wait. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, you know. I was just just waiting, and um, today I needed to come in and step up. So I just came out there and did my role. Well, how about you? You haven't had to wait. You've been starting and playing a lot the last month. But how does it feel to uh, have your uh, best game as a Cleveland? Well, uh, you know, it, it feel it feel real good though. Like, that's the best time. That's the best I ever played. Like all every game, defensively and offensively, I almost had a double double. I was one rebound away. But I just want to, I just uh, try to come out, play hard for the team, and do whatever I can to help us win. Mike, did you at any point worry that you wouldn't get this opportunity this season, that you'd have to wait till next year to show your coach, your teammates, and the fans what you're capable of doing? Um, it's not that I wasn't um, worried about that. I'm just trying to get better every day, and then whenever a coach needs me, you know, I can just come in and just try to help any way I can. Two possessions that were key, I thought. Come down with a three point play and, and get the hustle play on the other end. Talk about that. You, you put, put you up six, uh, both ends of the floor. Yeah. Uh, oh, yeah, I remember that. That's just from a coach pushing me in practice, telling me every time I, every time I, uh, I slack off, you know, push myself, go harder. Because in the game, you know, it's going to come to me. Plus, I gotta uh, step up, you know, be the more more of a hustle player, you know, try to get all the loose balls and stop anybody I can. <coughs> Trey, you held them as a team under thirty percent shooting. Was that something you guys came out and said, if we want to end this skid, we have to do it defensively? Definitely, that's big. That was one of our um, emphasis. You know, we uh, we knew if we kept their percentage down, we had a big chance of winning. You know, the last couple of games. Team's been scoring too high on us, you know, um, percentage-wise. And our goal was to keep them under forty percent. You know, um, we did that, and so, you know, that's why we came out victorious. If we continue doing that, um, we don't have a lot of success down the road. Anything else for the student athletes? Did you guys know you had them without a field goal the last nine minutes? Um, I didn't know that. I just know we're trying to shut them down. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, we did, we we wasn't, you know. We wasn't uh, sure of that, but we knew we was out there um, playing good defense. You know, our thing is to get five stops. You know, we always, you know, we always say to ourselves, five stops, five stops. And you know, if we keep doing that, you know, it's gonna, it's gonna show itself.